Tyler, the creator apologizes for hiding sexuality on new song Sorry Not Sorry, Tyler, the creator has issued a barrage of apologies, including one for hiding his sexuality, on his new song, Sorry Not Sorry. On Wednesday, March 29th, the Grammy-winning artist dropped the repentant track and its accompanying music video on YouTube as he continues to build excitement for his forthcoming project Call Me If You Get Lost, The Estate Sale. At the beginning of the video, DJ Drama opens the track by continuously screaming, I'm sorry. Which is a prelude to the amount of beg pardons Tyler drops throughout the desert set visual. Tyler, the creator then apologizes to the men and women who he lied to about his sexuality. Many people believe he came out as gay on his 2017 LP Flower Boy, sorry to the freaks I led on slash who thought their life was gonna change cause I gave em head on slash but instead, I sped off, yeah, I know I'm dead wrong slash sorry to the guys I had to hide slash sorry to the girls I had to lie to, who ain't need to know if I was by the lake switching tides, too, he raps over the sample heavy track. Tyler also extends apologies to his mother, his old friends, the fans who said I changed, his ancestors and even those whose pronouns he gets wrong. He also appears alongside multiple old Tylers from throughout his career, who serve as antagonists to his protagonist perspective about his present-day mentality. The video was released on March 26, 2013, Ariana Grande paid homage to her late ex Mac Miller on the 10th anniversary of their groundbreaking duet The Way which took both their careers to the next level. She shared a short video of the music video on her Instagram story Sunday. The song was released in 2013 and was their first top 10 hit on the Billboard Hot 100 singles chart. It was also their first collaboration and it went on to be certified triple platinum. After the tragic death of Miller in 2018, Ariana Grande has been paying tribute to her late boyfriend with a series of heartfelt messages on social media. She has also released songs about her former love, including Thank You. Next in Ghostin. The song is no longer available on YouTube but an updated version of the song was re-released this week, featuring a whole slew of artists who added their support. The Black Eyed Peas, Andra Day, Jaden Smith, Wiz Khalifa and Usher are among those who have stepped up to support the singer. The song was a hit, Ariana Grande paid tribute to her late ex-boyfriend Mac Miller on the 10th anniversary of their collaboration The Way. The songstress reposted a short video on her Instagram stories that was shared by an account dedicated to the former Nickelodeon star, and it's clear she's still a fan of her late pal. The song was released in 2013 and it became Grande's first top 10 hit on the Billboard Hot 100 singles chart. It also won her the prize for best song from a female artist at the MTV Video Music Awards that year. The song was written by Miller and produced by Grande. It was a collaboration that took both their careers to the next level. It also sprang to life with the help of one of Miller's close friends and collaborators, Thundercat. In fact, the song is credited with having helped launch the rapper's career. Sadly, Miller died in September of 2018 after an accidental overdose. 